I'm doing the workshop along with you this time so I can see how it goes from your point of view. I'm going to click the link now and enter the workshop as a student. This is what I saw. I filled out the title, said a few things about the poem in the submissions text box, and I attached the file. First I chose it, then I pushed the submit button. This is what I saw when that was done. And that's the way it looked for a couple of days. Uh, if you want to know when each phase is, look at those dates on the upper left-hand corner. Um, okay, we're in the submissions part now, and I have two poems to submit, and somebody has um, given me feedback, too. So that's nice. I think the first thing I wanted to do was to look at my feedback. Let's show that. Yep, there's the feedback, and it really was helpful. Somebody else is going to give me feedback, too, and I'm looking forward to it. Now I think I'll do my job and look at feedback. Uh, here's one of the poems that I got to give feedback on. I opened it first, and then I went to the text box area to write about it. And there's the typing I did. When I was done, I clicked the Save the Assessment button, and it told me well, it had a continue button and I pushed that too. And this is where I ended up after I continued. Now I want to do the next one. Uh, press assess again and you get to assess. Um, when I did that, the assessment text box wasn't showing, but that big thick gray line can be dragged down and then you can see it. That may happen to you too. Don't let it scare you. So, I finished my assessments, and this is what the screen says, edit, under the actions column. That means I can go back in and edit if I need to. So that's all there is. This is the Moodle workshop. I hope it works well for you, and I hope you get great feedback. Talk to you later.